end of the road for South Carolina's longest serving sheriff pleading guilty in federal court. Good evening to you. I'm Janet Parker. And I'm Brian McConkey. Retired Lexington County Sheriff James Metz admitting to a federal judge today that he harbored illegal aliens. And that admission, part of a plea agreement that will allow Metz to avoid trial on 10 charges. Our Tara Pettit was in the courtroom this morning. She joins us in the newsroom now with more. This was his second chance at a plea agreement, just two weeks before he was scheduled to go on trial. But with the federal judge's decision to accept the agreement, James Metz will not have to face a jury. Any comment, comment from the media, sir? I am pleading guilty because I am in fact guilty. That is what former Lexington County Sheriff James Metz said in federal court on Tuesday. Judge Terry Wooten accepting a plea agreement from Metz's legal team, but not before hearing from prosecutors first. Federal Prosecutor Jay Richardson telling the court there is a risk in bringing Metz to trial when the two key witnesses who would be testifying were co-conspirators. The agreement, Richardson added, left plenty of room for the judge's discretion because it did not define a sentence. Metz is pleading guilty to harboring illegal aliens, just one of ten counts he was indicted on earlier this year. His lawyers, Sherry Leiden and Scott Schools, acknowledged that while this is a case of public corruption, the former sheriff made great strides during his 42 years as sheriff. Judge Wooten accepted the plea agreement. However, he did not make a decision on what kind of sentence Metz is facing. And the bottom line in all of this is that Metz will not be going to trial next month. Judge Terry Wooten did not give a time frame on when Metz will be sentenced in the case. Live in the studio, Tara Pettit, Watch Fox News.